All right, we're getting our first look at new rides and attractions that could be coming to Disneyland. And yeah, the expansion plans still need to be approved, of course, by the city of Anaheim. KTLA 5's Orange County Bureau Chief Chip Yost there with more. Hi, Chip. Yeah, hey there, Glenn and Lou. Yeah, Disneyland has a bit of a problem. It's been a problem uh, pretty much forever here in Anaheim. It wants to expand, but unlike Disney World in Florida, it doesn't have a lot of land to work with here in Anaheim. So it is asking the city of Anaheim to have some of its property rezoned so it can build more attractions on areas uh, that might otherwise just stay parking lots. For instance, take a look at this video here. You may remember this video from the pandemic. This is this Toy Story parking lot. Remember, they used it as a vaccination site during the pandemic. Well, that's one of the areas Disneyland wants to have rezoned so that they can build more attractions on the property. Their idea is basically to blend maybe some new rides, restaurants, other attractions, all into different areas that right now they aren't zoned to be able to do that. So they're taking a big step on Monday. They've got a 17,000 page environmental impact report that they've completed. They're going to kind of talk to the Planning Commission about that on Monday and see you know, where they can go from here. This is kind of just really an early, early step in this process. It'll take a while. We talked to someone from the city, though, about how things could look different on Disneyland's property if they are approved to make the changes they want to make. The area west of the theme parks today, folks will know it. Part of downtown Disney is there. The Disneyland Hotel is there. The Paradise Pier Hotel, which has been renamed the Pixar Pier Hotel. We could see theme park attractions potentially added alongside those existing uses that we see today. That is one area west of the parks. Southeast of the park, an area folks know as the Toy Story parking lot, it could potentially see theme park uses alongside restaurants, dining, entertainment, shopping. That would be a second area. Third area would be on the east side of the theme parks where we could see additional parking. Now, on one hand, uh, this latest uh, development that they've got this 17,000 page environmental impact report that they're having this meeting with the Planning Commission on Monday is kind of boring. It's a lot of technical stuff, uh, things that probably put you to sleep if you started reading it all. But for Disney fans, it's exciting because they get to talk about and speculate about what Disney might do if they put, if they're able to build on some of this land right now that they're not allowed to build on. A lot of people are talking about possibly a frozen land or a Zootopia land, things like that. So a lot of talk about what could go there, but first they have to get the approval from the city to do that. And we're told that could take months, maybe middle of next year before any final decision is made. For now, we're putting live here in Anaheim. I'm Chip Yost, KTLA 5 News.